The Queen's long-time aide reportedly warned Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's marriage would all end in tears according to reports in a new royal book. Tom Bauer, royal author of new book Revenge, Meghan, Harry and the War Between the Windsors, claimed Lady Susan Hussey made the damning comments about the Duke and Duchess of Sussex before they tied the knot in a glorious Windsor wedding. Lady Susan, who has been the Queen's lady-in-waiting since the 1960s and is Prince William's godmother, is said to have issued a warning at a lunch with a group of theatre executives, according to columnist Richard Kay. Writing for the Daily Mail, he quoted Mr. Bower's book saying one of the Queen's lady-in-waiting warned Prince Harry and Meghan's marriage would all end in tears. Mr. Kay said, Bower writes, while discussing the possibility that Meghan might become linked with the National Theatre after the wedding, Hussey became unexpectedly serious about the couple's future. That will all end in tears, she is alleged to have warned. Mark my words. Lady Susan, Baroness Hussey of North Bradley, is said to have offered advice and support to help Meghan settle into life within the firm when she was living at Nottingham Cottage. But the Duchess is understood to have been insistent she would not let the firm change her mind. Mr. K added, she was said to have visited the Duchess at Nottingham Cottage, the home she shared with Harry in the grounds of Kensington Palace, to offer help and advice, the book claims. In response, the American-born actress was said to be insistent that she would not allow Buckingham Palace to shape her, dictate her thoughts or activities. Harry, and Meghan, a former U.S. actress, married in a lavish Windsor ceremony in May 2018, a wedding which was heralded at the time as infusing a blast of Hollywood glamour and modernity into the monarchy, and making them one of the world's biggest celebrity couples. But the Duke and Duchess of Sussex, who share son Archie Harrison and daughter Lilibet Diana, sparked a royal crisis when they publicly announced in January 2020 they wished to step back from royal duties and spend more time in the U.S. away from the public spotlight. A later deal brokered by the Queen meant they went on their own way from April 2020. Lady Susan Hussey is one of the Queen's ladies-in-waiting and travelled with the monarch to the Duke of Edinburgh's funeral service. Lady Susan who is married to the late BBC chairman Marmaduke Hussey, is godmother to Prince William and reportedly close friends with Prince Charles. She has been a friend to the Queen since 1960 when she became her woman of the bedchamber. She was initially employed to respond to letters after Prince Andrew's birth. She is the youngest daughter of the 12th Earl Waldegrave and Mary Hermione, Countess Waldegrave. The role of lady-in-waiting has existed in Britain for centuries, and often ladies-in-waiting hail from the nobility. Ladies-in-waiting assist the Queen with her official duties. As such, they may be entrusted to assist with running errands and attend to personal matters. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle have been totally lost since they moved to America after stepping down as senior royals. The parents of two recently came under fire in royal biographer Tom Bower's new book which prompted the beginning of the conversation between Piers and Sharon. The former Good Morning presenter, 57, has made no secret about his feelings towards the pair over the years and claimed the new book paints a pretty awful picture of them. Piers then turned his attention to Sharon and asked, What do you make of these two? What's going on with them? The former X Factor star admitted she thinks the pair are totally lost because they're still trying to find their place in the world.